Today I am in Akihabara and we are going to explore the Electric Town area, show you some of the awesome things to do in the Akihabara district, which is kind of the video games and electronics and anime area. Then we're gonna go to Ame Yokocho in Ueno. So it should be a fun night. Let's go guys, let's go. But first we are going to go to Ichiran, uh, which is a very popular ramen spot. I've been wanting to try this for a while. I haven't had a bowl of ramen since I've been back in Japan, so it is about time. So dodging the rain here, but we're gonna go check out Ichiran. Hello. So, guys, we got in early. Okay. Alright guys, so when you purchase you get a ticket printed out and then you choose your preferences and everything is individual seating. So part of the attraction of each round is that you can eat by yourself and be individual. And over here on this side, if you are shy, you can just sort of like pick one of these. Um, and uh, yeah, that way you don't have to talk. <laughs> and everything's per partitioned off. They even close this after they take your order. Okay, wow, so, so polite. So I got spicy, extra pork in the egg. And I guess you have to peel it yourself, but oh man, this smells so good, guys. Try the broth. It's tonkatsu ramen, so it's a pork. Mm. Mm. Oh, nice and garlicky. Mm. Finally got it peeled, guys. I wish you could see this. The egg is just perfect. Look at that egg. The broth is just so full of flavor. It's one of my favorite broths I've had for ramen. And the noodles are a bit thin, but the pork is really, really good. And overall, this is a really, really high quality bowl of ramen in my opinion. Cheers. Guys, one thing I wanted to point out is, so it's Saturday here. It's extremely busy. And as you can tell, everybody's got their umbrellas. So with the busyness and all the umbrellas, it actually kind of makes walking around Tokyo a bit of a, a bit of a challenge, guys. But yeah, we're not gonna spend the whole video here in Akihabara. It's just a place that I love and I thought it would be cool to show Bambi over here, Akihabara. If you're a fan of anime and video games, this is the place for you. So we're just walking towards Electric Town here. So you can see the massive arcade over here. All of these ramens. And I don't think I've ever checked out this building. Guys, do you see that uh, truck? There's music coming out of that truck. <laughs> Alright Bambi, do you want me to win you a stuffed animal? Do you want me to win you a stuffed animal? Alright, let's go. All right, we'll see if I can do this. Okay, Bambi. Let's see what we're gonna get. Guys, I usually can't film this stuff because it's only me holding the camera, but today we're going to try and watch, do a little crane gambling. Let's see, do I have enough? I got 1,000. Or maybe this pink one. Maybe the pink one? Yeah. Oh, I need coins. Okay, I got one. I got 200 here. Let's try this. All right. You ready, guys? One. Let's try it again. 
I think my IC card will work. So let's see here. Alright, so my Suica should work here. Alright, let's see here. Let's see. <laughs> let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. These are hard guys. We're gonna find another one. I'm gonna win a set damage. Alright guys, I think we're gonna find a few more crane games to play somewhere. Okay, we're gonna check out this shop. We're not even sure what it is, but it looks cool. It's sort of like an anime figures shop. Oh, this one says Traveler. Genshin Impact. Okay guys, we have a mission for this Aki Hopper trip, so Bambi's nephew loves Sonic. So we're trying to find him a Sonic figurine or something so she can get him a gift from Japan. So there's a Sega building. Sonic is Sega, not Nintendo. So there's a Sega building up here. I might be able to do it. So this is our first side quest. Find a Sonic figurine. We've got two qu side quests. Play some crane games and try to find a uh, Sonic figure. All right, let's choose one, Bambi. You want that one? All right, let's do this one. Okay, so I gotta get coins. Which one do you want? The purple one. Purple. All right. Thank you for visiting. I'll try, I'll try. Okay, you wanna try? Okay, Bambi's gonna try. We ask for our visitors to secure our vicious looking people. Thank you for visiting us. Oh no. Did she get it? No. Oh, that's as far as it goes back. Oh my god, they think you got it. Oh my gosh. Alright, I'm going yellow again. Okay. Oh. I do think I can get the yellow too. Oh my god! Ah uh, no! No! <laughs> so close! Alright guys, we got one, two, three, four, five chances left. We're getting a stuffed animal, let's go. Oh, no. Oh, it's now too close to the red, guys. Alright. Let's see what? here. Wait, we're gonna try yellow again. Yellow. No. How much will you lose? It's okay. I want. I want. I want to win more. I am tilted right now, guys. Oh, my. I am tilted right now. We got two shots. No, zero percent. Oh, this is the final shot, guys. One more shot. Oh. <laughs> oh, guys, 1,000 yen wasted. It's all right. It was fun. It was fun. Got Kirby's here. I don't know what those are. They look like UFOs. Bunch of like crazy anime figurines. 
These are really expert mode. All right, so I'm using my IC, it's super easy. Okay. You want to pick one? Yes. All right. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, guys. <laughs> Okay. Can I go again? Yeah. I want to do two. I want to do two plays. Okay. Guys, this is 100% gambling. I, I do not endorse gambling. We'll have to figure out, I don't know. We'll, we might do side quests too and find a Sonic because I don't think Bambi's getting a stuffed animal today, guys. <laughs> oh no, don't give up. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Let's go. I don't know how to do these. This is crazy. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, we uh, failed our quest of buying a stuffed animal and finding a Sonic toy. <laughs> and the rain's getting annoying, so we're actually gonna walk in the rain, but towards uh, Amayoko. So we're about ready to uh, do some uh, other things other than anime. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, guys. We are now close to the. We're in the Wayno area, and we're gonna explore this area. It's a fun shopping district and maybe we'll get some highballs or something later so let's explore Wayno and Ami Yokocho we're gonna go to Modoc which is like uh, part of the same company as Book Off it's like thrift shop and stuff like that okay guys I think I'm gonna pick up this jacket it's 2,000 yen okay the zipper's a little weird but I'm a little uh, cold from this rain and we're going to a cold place soon after Tokyo. So yeah, anyway, here it is. Guys, perfect fit. 2,000 yen, which is like uh, $14, $12, something like that. All right, we're all set. All right, guys, we might do some more shopping here. Might stop for a bite and, and a drink. This is a great spot for shopping, for drinking, all of that. So this is definitely one of the funnest places I would say in Tokyo this is kind of like I've di I did a whole video on this but it's like an izakaya alley and each one of these bars all of them have a cover charge but it's fun you just kind of sit outside drink get little bites to eat and I think we will stop somewhere around here and grab something You can see like inside it's like pretty pretty awesome. It is quite a struggle guys walking around here with an umbrella right now as you can see. But worth it, worth it nonetheless. Okay guys, we have just picked an izikaya here and uh, I think we're gonna get some karage and fried potato and then we were saying we might drink here for a little bit because <laughs> they have so many things that we want to try. Uh, this one lemon and sour plum and I'm gonna get a Sapporo because I haven't had one in a while. It looks like bean sprouts is the uh, side dish that you pay for. Not bad, not bad. Wow guys, this is the big bottle. Let's give it a shot. Cheers. 
Oh, Sapporo. Freaking good. Let me try it. Oh, try this. Okay, we wanted to get adventurous here. This is shark cartilage. I don't know, guys. When in Japan? I'm probably not gonna eat almost any of this. Not for me. Not for me. Oh my god. I mean, I don't like it. That's it for me. Okay, guys. Something not adventurous. Chicken, thai, green, onion skewers. This is the way. Cheers. This is one of the best yakitoris. Alright guys, they transferred us inside. I'm not sure why. I'm not super happy about it, but we got the large size. So wow. Come by. We're gonna have to get back, but we'll get back. Uh, now these, these are good. We had an amazing time at that izakaya, kind of. They kind of rushed us through the order, which I wasn't happy about, but it is what it is. Anyway, tomorrow is my birthday, so we're not done. Actually, Bambi suggested we should go drink more for my birthday. Yeah, exactly. So we're gonna go drink more, but we're gonna go back to Shinjuku. That way we're close. So we'll take you with us. Let's go. We are back in Shinjuku. We're gonna find a spot to get a few more drinks. Let's go, guys. Uh, I only have a few more hours in, of uh, being 31 left. So soon I'll be 32. Let's make the best of it. All right, well, we found ourselves back at o Omoide. Yoko Joe and uh, yeah I'm gonna get a draft sapro and we're gonna have a few drinks here and then see where the night takes us guys so we'll take you along with us cheers come by oh that's the black label sapro oh that is good and it's on draft cheers guys come by okay guys uh, we just put a hundred in here and this just popped out Let's see here. Uh, guys, so we got the three meat skewer. Uh, someone tell me, what is this? <laughs> it's sort of like a... It's like, hexa it's it's like hex hexagonal. I have no idea what that is, dude. That might be tongue. Spicy french fries. We moved inside because it was raining. Oh, she does. Very good, very good. Alright, I think we're gonna end, or at least go to this ale house here and uh, see what we can find. We'll see if we can get a find, find a seat. If not, we'll go somewhere else. Bye! Good? Okay, good call, yay! So we're at the uh, British pub. It's the only one open, but uh, she got the China Blue and I got a Kirin. So, come by. Good morning guys from the next day. We're just gonna kind of wonder, enjoy my birthday. And yeah, we'll just wander around Japan. But we saw this little market type thing here. Figured we'd check it out. And it's selling really nice art. And uh, yeah, this is pretty cool.
got my I Love Japan shirt on. <laughs> Guys, this is so cool. This is like a thrift market, basically. So people are selling like crafts, like candy crafts and used items. It's very interesting. It is Sunday, so maybe this is only a Sunday thing, but yeah, this is nice. We have made our way to Kabuchiko here during the day and it's fun as ever. You can see the Godzilla head over here and there's this massive Don Quixote. So we're going to actually go check it out. These are always fun. So let's go. Oh, they have Godzilla memorabilia here. Of course, that makes sense. That makes sense. And they might have like Halloween stuff here at this time. Yeah, they do. Well, Bambi. Since I didn't get, since I didn't win you a crane, how about we just hack it? Okay. <laughs> nah. Let's pick one. All right, so Bambi needed some luggage for the next journey of our, leg of our journey here. So she bought this for herself. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah, and it's uh, tax free. So 5,000 yen or more purchase, tax free. You just gotta show your passport. Yeah, pretty cool place. Guys, I'm thinking about buying an, an Apple Watch for myself for my birthday, but I don't know if I'm gonna pull the trigger yet. I gotta, I gotta, <laughs> I gotta uh, see how it feels on my wrist, and I don't know if I need it, but it would be a nice like, uh, it would be a nice like life improvement, like quality of life improvement. Let's we'll see. All right, guys, we saw this yesterday, and we thought it looked really cool, and I, I'm thinking this is where I want to have birthday lunch. Oh yeah, yeah, we're gonna be able to get something good here. All right, let's go here. Hopefully there's not a wait. Look at this cool restaurant, guys. And we might go to the beer hog. So guys, this is Japanese food, Korean food, Thai food. So it's like a three in one, kind of cool. Okay guys, this is so cool. So as you look at the menu here, the food is from different areas like in Japan. So this is Bukoku uh, ramen. But then as you look down, like this is from Yamaguchi, Fuku, Bukoku, Saitama. And it gives you the different areas of where the food originates from. Like this one's from Osaka. Yeah, pretty cool. So apparently there's a Filipino tradition where you should eat noodles on your birthday for long life. So I'm gonna try one of these yakisoba noodles. All right, long life. Mm. That is nice. That yakisoba taste. Mm. Like a sweet sort of soy sauce. Mm. It's nice. All right, guys, and I got a, uh, it's like a pork bowl. So this looks like, oh, it's actual fried. I thought it was grilled. Oh, maybe it's grilled. I don't know. But you got the egg on there, rice on the bottom. Oh, let's crack that egg open. Let's break that egg open all over it. Oh, oh, look at that. Huh. Interesting. It's like really, really grilled. Almost like bacon. Yum. This is a miso pork skewer. Good shot. Yeah. Oh yeah. It has a sweet miso glaze on it and the pork's pretty well cooked. I would say. Let's try one of these goizas. They're kind of burnt. They're kind of burnt. I'm not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. But cheers, this is a really fun experience being in here. Look at that, guys. Bambi got me. Thank you, Bambi. Well, that's a cool spot. That is a cool spot. Tell me, is that like a. We noticed like almost all of the food was burnt and since it has different styles from all over the world we're just wondering is that like a thing because usually in the restaurants here in Japan the food is very precise like cooked very perfectly but food is, was burnt here so I don't know interesting 
I was a game time decision on drinking since we were out all last night. But I really want to go into this Shinjuku Ale House and get myself a Sapporo, if they have Sapporo. Especially on tap, that would be amazing. Okay, so here's the Shinjuku Beer Hall. Looks cool guys, let's go. Oh, look. It has like a tavern feel, like you're in a tavern. An old timey tavern. <laughs> Okay, let's see here. Can we find the English language? English, okay. Here. Yeah, I want a Sapro draft. We could get a beer boot glass, guys. But I think I'm gonna do a medium here. <laughs> Mammy's not drinking today, but uh, I am. So, cheers, Sapro. Oh, that is killer. That is absolutely killer. Cheers. Okay, guys, this is my uh, slice of birthday pie. Okay, here it is. It's uh, apple pie. Apple pie is good. Tiny fork. Tiny fork. Mmm, it's warm. Oh. Oh. That is nice. Oh yeah, and the vanilla ice cream, whipped cream. Oh, that is really nice, guys. All right, guys, what an amazing birthday here in Japan. 32, feels the same as 31. Anyway, thank you so much for being here. Stay tuned for more Japan adventures, and I'll most certainly be talking to you again soon. Peace.